A rescue package is on its way to the House after the Senate unanimously approved it overnight. The $2 trillion package will give money to businesses, workers, and the health care system. Direct payments could range from $1,200 to $2,400. Joining us live this morning is Bill Dendy, the president of Elite Financial Management. So with some practical advice for all of us as we deal with this and many people looking at their bank account closing in on zero, waiting for these checks, what do you recommend? Well, what you do with this depends on your own personal situation. For those who are in that situation where they're seeing the bank account get lower and lower, uh, who are maybe unemployed, they need to hold on to this money because we don't know how long this pandemic is going to last and when we really are going to get back to work. And so they may want to negotiate with some of their uh, creditors to see what needs to be paid, what can be weighted, and don't spend the money. Don't treat this like a stimulus package, but build up your own reserves. For those who are in secure positions, they have this money and they can do what they wish to do with this money. But for many people, probably the best answer is get rid of high interest credit card debt. For those of us who are paying credit card debt over 9%, we should certainly look at chipping that away because that's uh, the quickest way to get a guaranteed rate of return by just eliminating that debt. Uh, beyond that, uh, we can look at building our cash reserves for future emergencies and then look at maybe putting the money to work in the marketplaces. We're seeing a lot of ads out there right now, you know, zero percent interest we will make your payments if you lose your job. Should people really consider making a big purchase right now with incentives like that? The challenge here is this is a relief package, not a stimulus package, and the relief package was unanimously voted in because we really need the relief. There is a real risk that this pandemic lasts a little longer than expected. All right, Bill Dendy, thank you so very much for being with us this morning. Some sound advice for people who are waiting on those checks that cannot get here soon enough.